ABC Channel One. Very well, welcome to Business Defined, where we talk matters of business locally, regionally, and internationally. Glad you could join us today, this Monday morning of the 19th of May 2014. I'm your host, Regina Manyara Gitao. Later in the course of the program, we will be discussing matters of tourism in light of the current travel advisories that we've seen being issued against a country that is from Britain, France, and Australia. But before we get to those matters, let us look at what is making headlines in the business world and online to offer the world to access affordable housing units as Turkish-based investor Elsec group of companies introduces a new building technology in the country. The company is targeting to reach the middle and low income groups in the country. The new technology uses prefabricated building techniques using the fiber, cement and galvanized steel which is cheaper compared to the conventional construction methods. With a growing number of the middle class in the country, the appetite for housing is increasing faster than the market can deliver. This has led to widespread shortage of houses across major towns in the country, such as Nairobi, Mombasa and Kisumu. In Kenya, the challenge for many home builders and real estate developers is access to affordable finance, which in turn makes the dream of affordable housing a distance dream. But these conditions are set to significantly improve with the introduction of new building technologies in the country by a Turkish investor. According to Esmek Elsek, president of the Elsek group of companies, so we have to find a solution that the people has to be inside the house when they pay the, their first down payment. The rest they have to pay uh, during, uh, during when they are inside, they are living, during they are living inside, they have to pay. So otherwise there is no good financial solution uh, will be for the Kenyan community. LSEC says time taken when constructing using these modern technologies very short and within no time a prospective plant will be shifting to the new house complete with basic house needs. We are building a house now, uh, 35 minutes you can sleep inside the house. It is coming in flat pack with, uh, with the foundation inclusive, so we are giving you guarantee of 60 years. Of course, this is the question, how long will it take? He said the company already rolled out a decent low-cost housing unit, which meets the country's building regulations. Meanwhile, in a bid to tap into the ever-growing regional market for the housing units, the group CEO said they are now eyeing the larger markets in Uganda, Tanzania, Rwanda and South Sudan and make affordable housing for the mass there in reality. We have other inquiries from Uganda, Tanzania, uh, Southern Sudan, but uh, we, we, like, we like to stay in Kenya. With a down payment ranging between 10,000 Kenyan shillings and 30,000 Kenyan shillings and a similar amount in monthly installments, Kenyans are able to occupy their dream house with one bedroom, two bedrooms and three bedroom house going for 350,000 Kenyan shillings, 750,000 Kenyan shillings and 800,000 Kenyan shillings respectively. Jeremiah Gola reporting for Business Defined. 